The Community Driven Development Project has contributed to promote and empower women. The way husbands now view their wives has considerably changed from what it used to be. They show more respect. My name is Soton Felicien. I am 52 years old and my village is called Ajegunle. I have seven children. The oldest is 35 years old and the youngest is 11. My husband has six wives and 20 children. He is a farmer and given the size of the family, it was very difficult for him to feed and care for all of us. Each one of the six wives had to fend for herself and take care of her children. Only two out of my seven children have been able to attend school. We used to live in extreme poverty. It was difficult to get food and we could not afford three meals a day. To make a living, I used to produce and sell traditional soap and I would do any kind of job I found. We were very excited when the project came. We were trained and we learned a lot of things that we didn't know before. We formed an association of 20 women and we chose to produce a food called gari, which was made out of cassava. We meet every Thursday at a given place to do our work. We peel the cassava and then proceed with the production. Every member contributes to every stage of the production process. We make a good profit from the gari production. From the benefit I make, I have been able to buy a plot of land on which I have planted palm trees. I planted palm trees because I can produce palm oil and sell and this will generate more money for me. I am now able to keep my two children in school, pay for their school fees, buy their books and stationaries. The result now is that for the first time, one of my children has got his O-level degree. Another thing that I have been able to do is that I bought a motorbike for my son to help him get to school quickly. And he can also use it for motor taxi during his free time to make some money. I have hope for my children. My prayer is that they wouldn't suffer as I suffered myself. I pray that they get good jobs which will help them satisfy the needs for their families and care for me when I get old. 